October 27. So, so I'm back with Bandicam. Uh, I dropped a BS because it was lagging a lot and uh, I had several issues with uh, with sound not recorded. So I'm back with Bandicam. And as you can see, there is no uh, banner here because I bought Bandicam. Um, so it's, it's a bit expensive, but I thought let's support them. And it's uh, for life. I mean, the license is for life, so it's good. So I did the battle at the Lost Library and I almost died <laughs> for the second time, I think, in this game. And I was like, fuck, I'm going to lose that top 8 so early. Uh, but in the end, I managed to save the day, but uh, Tree is dead. And most importantly, the baby shock happened is dead. Uh, which is really a, a shame because I could have evolved him into uh, a King Shock Serpent, which would have made a big difference. So, yeah. Uh, actually, it was bad luck somehow because if I had uh, better luck, I would not have lost probably a single unit. I, I One of my units got converted, and it was the worst unit uh, to convert. It was the boar rider. So uh, I did what I usually do, so I split with uh, the spider here and the rest of the army there. And uh, I said it was bad luck, but actually it was also a misplay, uh, because I retreated the spider too much. So here I positioned my units here to be more than three axes away from the... From the um, the evangelists, uh, so that they cannot charm them, and uh, my leader is, is at range, but he cannot be charmed because he has mind control immunity. And so, as, as planned, they, they buff each other on run one, uh, but I didn't check, I didn't pay attention to the fact it was an orc animator, so he has throw curse, which means instead of going towards the spider run, he also goes this way to throw a curse on, on my units because he cannot on the spider run because it's machine. And it means they are all at the same place. So then I have to move the spider run towards them to try to lure some of them to our to the spider run. And then retreat with the rest of the units, uh, stay out of uh, convert range, and uh, and uh, keep staying on range with my leader, but outside out of range of the of the white witch. So she has only one valid unit. It's the spider run. So, so far it works well, like, I, I, I split them 3-2 uh, uh, with these three guys against the Spider-Man, all the range units against the Spider-Man and the rest against me. And they have this uh, Super Evangelist, uh, Tigran Evangelist, so it's, it's fast, athletic, and he has all the buffs. So, uh, get, get in Flame, Frozen Flames, and uh, Touch of Faith, so it's, it's quite dangerous, doing a lot of damage for chance. Um, so in addition to uh, convert, I have to pay attention not to be, to be hit by him. So then, I put my units all away from each other, uh, not adjacent, so that if when he tries to convert me, if he, he succeeds, I take only one range damage uh, uh, maximum if he converts the prospector. And uh, Borider is outside of range, so it cannot be converted and, and, uh, and the pistol used. Try to convert the prospector, it fails. So so far, so good. But but that's where I failed. Uh, I moved back the spider run too much, and they didn't pursue it. They went back. So I should have kept the spider run here, and then it would probably have exploded. But I would have kept my other units probably because here I have too much pressure uh, as they all they all come back. Uh, towards here, and I cannot just go around and attack them as if uh, what would have what would have happened if if they had moved towards the spider. I would have only destroyed it. I could deal with them efficiently. So, so I killed the 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 Tigran, uh, this round, and I cannot finish him with the with the prospector. So I have to finish him with the leader. And then, and then I got, I got my boar rider uh, converted by the by the other evangelist, and, and I, I tried to bring back the spider into the action, but it's too late. 
So they even so just, just convert, convert the, the Borite 40% chance, chance and it succeeds. And then I need to kill the Evangelist uh, in order to be able to to get back my Borider. And uh, worse, I've, I've, I've got this cadaver, cadaver from the from the rain meter who is trying to kill my uh, Serpent too. So, so I have a I very have small very chance, chance to kill him if I do a critical. And the evangelist is my leader, but small, small chance, chance because actually, actually I think it's not, I don't I have another chance actually when morale is high. You have to be. Oh, 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 oh yeah. I, uh, no, you have no, to be very high, very high to, be, to be able to do a, a critical. So, so he's left, he's left with, with uh, 22, 22 HP, HP and, and I could I try to try attack to him with the prospector, but I would not be able to kill him, or I could also, uh, also uh, flank the, the, the cadaver and then attack him with the uh, baby shark serpent, but I would not kill him. And he's going to heal himself on the next turn, so it doesn't make a big difference to attack him to bring him to 10 HP, so instead I, I kill the, the cadaver. So at, so this, at point, this point, I'm, I'm uh, one, two, uh, one, three, two, four, five, five units versus four. four. With one, one is going one to die. And Spider is out of the action, and the and the and the, and the, and the prospector to actually uh, uh, is going to die. Uh, so, so then they kill the, the prospector, prospector, but I got, I got somehow a bit lucky, lucky, and they need three units to kill it. And, and uh, uh, they kill the, the baby shark seven. Then, then I can only finish, finish the. the so, so now I'm, no, I'm, I'm, like I'm like five versus two, two plus one useless less units. Units. So, so, so very likely to die, but I managed to kill that evangelist. And on the side note, I could not cast spell because of the anti magic field. So I killed the evangelist. Then I my my bow rider is back, and I can kill the. The witch, and then and it's back three versus two, so it's good again. Especially since my leader has 80% uh, fire protection and 100% uh, black protection. Black protection. So, so that's also why I entered the fight because my leader is quite impressive. 19 defense, healing, keep away, extra, and fame. fame. So, so yeah, yeah, if, if I had I kept the spy drone uh, at range, I would have exploded, but I would have. I've been able to, to kill most of them, and uh, if the 40% chance comes out that failed, would have been very different. So then I just uh, retreat and heal and stuff and kill the two units. So, two units left on me. Then I did the battle at uh, Magma Forge with my leader and... Uh, oh yeah, 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 something else. Actually... <laughs> Uh, on the previous turn, I had uh, the Marauder around here, and I said, like, I was go I'm going to bring back the Marauder here and uh, do the fight six or four, five. But, so that would also have been very different, I think. Uh, because, for instance, I would have been able to kill the Evangelist uh, with uh, about 10 more damage from the, from the Marauder. But I had made a mistake, and my, my Marauder was too far away, something like, like here, and uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, so it was something like here. He could, could not go, go back, back to the to the, uh, to the to last the library. library. So, so it was five versus five. five. So, so another mistake was to, to move too far away on the previous turn. So, so yeah, I did the magma forge two versus, two versus uh, four, four, and, and uh, it, was it was not too difficult, difficult because, because I had my leader with eighty percent fire protection and the bow rider is quite resistant and plus one plus one resistance. So, so I just, I just uh, uh, brought, brought the, the, some, some, some of the some units some toward me, and, and then killed them, them and killed myself with uh, Slip Away and Healing and, and uh, Garden Flame, and, and uh, it went okay. So, so I just, just bait the uh, Hellhound, kill it, bait the uh, Nightmare, nightmare kill it. Kill it. And then kill the two, uh, the two uh, hatchings. So it was not not so difficult. And then I've got good healing, so could bring back my my HP. So yeah, as you see, I, and then you've got only the two uh, 
um, hatchlings left, I kill one and then I can kill myself extra. Um, so then I hesitate, should I go back to my, to my throne? But then it's three turns without doing any clearing. So I said, let's go, let's try to do the gold mine, and then I've got the sites here, uh, and I can and I can sit on it and get the gold mine. Otherwise, it will be very difficult to go back here and, and clear the gold mine. And uh, if I'm crazy, I can try to do this lost library uh, next turn four versus I don't know what. I didn't check it when I, I moved with Marauder. And then I can go back here and clear, clear this and, and go back here. The issue is that Johnny Thunder uh, sent some scouts, so one is here already and probably doesn't know that I've uh, watched over here. Um, so I'm going to try to do it. And uh, this flower query has been cleared, and this one is about to be cleared. It's still not cleared, I think. Yeah, it's still not cleared, but it's about to be cleared. And uh, so it means his armor is probably here. And just here. So if if I come back with my leader from here, I'm probably going to end up on Johnny Thunder. So I have to be careful. I have to be careful. And he's also sending a scoot here. So thanks to my to my watchtower, I am able to see it. Uh, and uh, I cast uh, a spy drive here. And then send it here. I am just in range. I, when I calculated it, I, I was not in range, but actually I'm just in range. So that's nice. Oh. I'm thinking, I'm thinking maybe, maybe I should, I instead of going, going attack, attack hit, hit, I should I just, just go here, here and, uh, because, because if, if I, I fail, fail um, I cannot, I cannot cast, cast, I would I need to cast, cast another spy drive here, here and, and go kill it, and then I and cannot I kill this one. one. Whereas, Whereas if I go, go for the, uh, for the inn, then, then I can recruit some minutes, minutes maybe, maybe a flyer, kill the scoot, and at least put one unit uh, on the cave entrance to prevent him from, from entering and I have another unit spy drone on the, on the inn to prevent him from recruiting so let's do this, looks like a better idea perfect perfect, perfect so let's hope I don't get killed by some crazy crazy shit uh, spells I, I hope I will not. Okay, good. I didn't cast spell myself. Um, so let's check his, his casting points and, and mana. Okay, so so it's casting points and a lot of mana. I think he's, he has reached his uh, his maximum. Ah, too fast. Anyway, he's close to maximum five hundred and forty. Um, so I'm probably going to go and scoot a little with my with air. And so now I can cast a second spy drone and go uh, kill the, the second uh, scoot. Here. Which is probably close to the to his arm. So I should go have a look at the cave entrance. But then I cannot guard the cave entrance if I do this. But still, I think it's the best thing to do. Check where it is. Interesting. So he's not, he's not around here. I thought he was, but he's not. And, uh, yeah, okay. So let's go kill it. It's, my, it's probably, probably going to be a draw. draw. Yeah, it's a draw. Check, Check if it casts some spells. So good, so I killed the two scouts, scouts and, and it's not, not directly not above the cave entrance. Yeah, so yes, that's six, 600. 600. Uh, 600. Mana, the casting points. And uh, let's check the stuff. Okay, so nothing. Good. Uh, so the last fight I did was... Was... 
I did two more. I'm sorry, I did two more fights. So one was at uh, Crystal Three against uh, apprentices. I did them with, with one bow rider uh, taking these two guys, and, and the rest of them taking these three guys. And I've got a lot of damage output, so I was able to kill them quickly, especially with the, the mammoth. Uh, the half things didn't get too lucky, so it was okay. And then I did the um, man and mammoth. And uh, so I've got these scoundrels, which I hope will attack me and get killed. And uh, I sent this builder here to save some time, because the scoundrel uh, will move for 7x and should not be able to attack it. And so then uh, I can build uh, the fort and have some movement points left. And uh, so bad, I cannot access this gold mine if I don't do the, the circle, but I'm not going to do it now. I'm probably going to kill the, the dungeon and then move uh, to the cave entrance and, and go attack uh, Johnny here. Uh, so the flyer entry is, is, is probably very helpful to um, to check uh, to check this defense here and make sure I can attack with my, my, my main army. Uh, so at my throne, now that I've killed the two um, Scoots, I can continue building Bow Riders, I think. And I hesitated. What the fuck? What the fuck? I used to be able to one turn. Did I? What the? Okay, so. The last, last, last turn, turn also, I wasn't able to one turn one the, the bow rider, I don't, I don't know. Uh, uh, I need to think what, what I should do, because it's, it's a waste to, to do them in, in two turns. turns. So maybe so I should build a seed workshop and, uh, and uh, one turn, turn them again. again. But, but actually I should... Removing the mana shield cell means I will need to cast it again and it will be a drain on my casting points. When I uh, need to cast Seed of Distrust on the, on the Dwelling, but I'm still far from it actually. And I, I also need some Spide Runes, so I can maybe keep the mana shield cell active because I've got 200 mana now. Um, or I can build some stuff that I can build in 81 production, like a uh, dwarf, I can't even build a, a dwarf engineer in one turn, it's a shame. Uh, dwarf deep guard is not, not very useful. Okay, I, I have to think about it at the end of the turn. Uh, here I wanted to uh, rush the dwarf settler. But I don't have the gold anymore, and actually I'm very well. I'm very low on, on gold income actually. Um, I also wanted. I also invited. I considered to uh, ask a tribute to my dwelling because I, I thought maybe I would, I'm going to be attacked by by Johnny. But uh, now that I see that I'm not going to be attacked immediately. I think it's better to wait, uh, otherwise I'm going to lose some income from the from the drawing, uh, from the vessel, and I need to be at 100 gold to uh, build a fortress here, even though it's not going to bring me any mana, which is a shame. Uh, but here I'm probably going to get it. No, I'm not going to get any gold. Actually, I'm going to get units. Um, so I need to get costs. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Maybe I should just. I should just uh, produce gold, produce merchandise here. So that was the situation for turn 27. See you next turn. Uh,